From dark forest to horseback riding, to Rumpelstiltskin to Sleeping Beauty, every single movement of Schumann's Martian Builder Viola Sonata will make you picture magic and fairy tales in your head. I hope you're ready, Viola gang. Let's hear the first movement. That's the iconic opening line, the musical version of Once Upon a Time. In my mind, I always picture walking into a dark forest during this movement. The sky is dark blue, and you can barely see anything other than silhouettes. Between the trees, you start to see fairies dancing. Sometimes, this moon also makes me think of an evil castle with winding staircases and pointy spires. At the end of the movement, the piano rises with a creepy trill before drifting back down to end on the tonic chord. The second movement is a complete contrast. This is a musical representation of horseback riding. My teacher interprets this movement as a warrior going on a hunt. You can hear the nobility in the character and the full sound of the chords and the virtuosity it demands from the violist. This movement is written in rondo form, so there's one section that recurs twice with two middle sections. The first middle section sounds like the warrior has an interaction with a small mischievous creature like a gremlin or a goblin. After the first section is restated, we have the second middle section, which is rough and heavy-handed. My teacher says this is like the warrior stops at a tavern. The main section returns and then fades away at the end, as if you're watching the warrior ride off into the distance. The third movement is the shortest, and it moves at breakneck speed. The intensity in the minor key suggests that a villain is the focus. With tricky arpeggios being passed between the viola and the piano, maybe that villain is Rumpelstiltskin. The final movement is slow and sweet, but tinged with sadness. It's a kind of mood that would fit the tale of Sleeping Beauty. The middle section is one of the most ethereal and emotional segments of music ever written. The melody you're about to hear exemplifies everything that makes the viol an amazing instrument.
The sonata ends peacefully with a singular pizzicato in the viola, as if you're drifting off into a dream. That's the magical March and Builder Viola Sonata by Robert Schumann, performed here by Tobey Zimmerman on viola and Christian Hadland on piano. It's one of my favorite pieces to listen to, and I'm actually going to get to perform it on my recital next month. I hope you enjoyed hearing some snippets from it, as well as my ideas about it. If you did, make sure you hit that thumbs up button down below, and subscribe if you want to see more viola content. Until next time, viola gang, viola king out.